Hello there everyone. If you're looking for that buried treasure, you need a good map and you need to be a good cartographer. As you look at the screen here, it says cartographer's name. The word cartographer comes from the root words, the Latin word charta, which means tablet or leaf of paper, and the Greek word graphene, which means to write or draw. And uh, you can see that there is a, a map here that is locked on a Google slideshow and what you can do here to make it more visible to you is to go into the upper right hand corner where the three dots are click on that come down here to this little uh, box click on that dashed box and it's going to increase your screen size you can see here right here i used a text box to uh, insert the northwest mountains and i can grab my um i was just trying to straighten it out a little bit more um there we go and then right here is your text box if you want to label something else just put your text box in there and then if you want to get your screen back to where it was you just take your cursor up here and you can see that the tabs will reappear if you go over here to the three dots again and then go down here it will reappear for you your tabs will reappear so again the three dots right here click on it go to the dashed rectangle and it will make your tabs disappear and you'll have a larger screen area with your map on it. Uh, again, take your cursor to the top and go to the three dots to bring your screen back when you click on the dashed area here. And so that's one option for you as far as creating your map. Another one, if for those of you who may want to go a little bit further, is to go to the National Geographic Map Maker. And here's the link for it. You'll click on that link and it says follow classroom resources and go to mapping so you'll have this website you go to classroom resources go to mapping when you click on mapping it is going to take you to that site if i'm patient there i'm going to close this box here so that you can see a little bit better if you scroll down a little bit it says launch the map maker and you can do that once you launch it uh, you can read the items that they have here and say, let me get started. There are many different options here for you. I'm just going to go back to the directions here that I had. And it says the help link provides a tutorial for using the program. Uh, there are many different layers that you can set uh, in the sample that I have here. I've turned on the ocean currents layer. You can see the, the arrows there. I've used base, a basic map here to get a number of things labeled the Northern European Plain. And the alpine mountain system you can put little symbols on you can uh, locate uh, places with uh, little circles here so that's another option for you too and uh, let's go back to the directions so again the help link is great for figuring things out there are short tutorials which are really great and when you click on the save link it enables you to share two copies are generated and emailed one can be shared as a read only which means changes cannot be made to it and the other one can be used for making continued modifications so again right up here we have help and then over here we have share so there are two wonderful options for you to use and uh, create your map as you become a cartographer